Dr. Stone, Chapter 70, Paper Shield. Okay. Oh, ho, ho, you're going to overhaul the cute little steam gorilla that worked so hard to build? The Kronlin tire. Cute. It's not cute. It's not very cute. It's not cute at all. But it's not cute. So I think of the same thing. That real tank. Reinforce, reinforce. Nope. We're going to power up. Huh? Really? So like getting pumped up? In that case, let's rebuild it. Quickly, quickly. In order to launch an attack that will rout our enemy. We'll turn it into a tank fortified with heavy armor. So make the whole body out of iron or something? If we do that, it'll get stupidly heavy. You think you'll be able to move? We're going for a quick attack, so speed is paramount. Got that right. Then, what will we use to make the tank? Paper. Like, wait, what? Vapor? Baker? Like, they're misunderstanding. I see. A paper tank. That will make it nice and light. Huh? What? It's like freaking out. Full steam ahead. Full metal jacket. Okay. Got the kids gathering up grains. Okay. Are you sure eating grass will do? Everyone's brought back tons of it. Yeah, probably. We'll boil this huge amount of grass with sodium hydroxide to loosen it up. Hi, I'm Mecha Seku. You turn a robot? If you're making this at home, then boil it with baking soda and a bleaching agent works. Then wash it, press it, and dry it. So they're making, actually making paper. Whoa, this is basically it. So paper is this easy to make, huh? Oh. Uh, this will make it much easier to write uh, blueprints and stuff. Up until, up until now, we've been writing on leather, creating a lot of waste. Old man's like, got it. Paper acquired. A man who understands the value of paper. People who don't. Like, pick your nose. How's this flimsy stuff going to be useful? Magnus just like pokes a hole through it. Thank you. It can't be. So don't tell me. You're planning to use this weak material to protect a, can to protect a tank. Nope. You got it right. You bring out a checkerboard pattern. Puts the paper over it. Wait. That looks just like a plain old paper screen door. Correct. 10 billion points for you. You pull it in a pot. Lastly. We hit it with an iron and it's done. Paper shield acquired. It's like it's coming Ginro's like chopping at the woods. Thank you. You might not know this. A spear yielders can pierce wooden shields in one strike. Do you really think you can deflect the Sukasa army's weapons with that paper shield or whatever it's called? I was wondering that too, brothers. Got him. Oh sure, perfect time for a test, isn't it? <laughs> Want to give it a try? Sanky versus Kinro. This is huge. Sanky and Kinro are going to do battle. We're all like getting hyped, and not just with practice weapons, but real ones. They said, "What? What's the meaning of this?" Chieftain's like doesn't understand. This is dangerous, Sanky. For me too. If you don't strike with all your strength, this is not a real test. That's the rule. And rules are rules, right? Always go to them in. When it comes to you. Understood, then. I definitely won't miss. It's like, ah! It's like, piercing through it? Do you actually do it? Huh? Thank you! Huh? Spear broke. Whoa! Thank you wins! Kenro's spear was the one that broke. The paper shield is unyielding. He. How did that paper shield, how did that paper screen door, like, they don't understand, looks like it got a hole through it. Ah, wait, hold on a second. The one who can answer those questions is useless right now. He's gone numb. Even if you block the blade, you've still got to deal with the shock. You painted something on it? Earlier, the stuff you painted on the paper wasn't just some ordinary glue, was it? <laughs> Very good. 10 to the power 14 points for you. The stuff that I was painted on was unhardened plastic from when we made the cell phones. Oh, 
Mixing the flexibility of the paper with the hardness of the plastic brings us the explosive entrance of carbon fiber. Oh, carbon. Uh, I may or may not have heard of that before. Wait, a lot of stuff's used. It's insanely light and insanely hard. It's the ultimate material for SS level mobility and SS level, and SS level defense. It's used in F1 car bodies, rockets, and the like. With this, we can do it. If we have a tank armored with, the, with those shields, breaking into the cell with a frontal assault, and rescuing Chrome without bloodshed is possible. Got Chrome's in his cell? Ah, uh, I take a leak. Eat it? Don't go over there. Like, oh, there's a hole? Shoot, that's a trap. Coal is, easy to, coal is easy to attain if you're not concerned with the quality. Hmm, in other words, the technology we must be wary of after gunpowder is attacks by steam powered vehicles. Steam powered. In this stone world, the Senku, they'll get there eventually. Mikasa, like, like, is on point. So that's why you can find him in that easily found place. That's also vulnerable to that kind of attack. I see, then. But Chrome Kun as bait. They lure him in. Senki may seem cool headed, but in reality, he can't ban his friends. That's his fatal weakness. Uh oh. Or look. Wah! The Sting Gorilla! Oh, they're gonna be trapped. Has become incredibly strong looking. <laughs> Gorilla like. Face first. That's because I added the double steamers. And this deadly big caterpillar style front wheel drive. Yep. Ding, huh? Hey, hey. Maybe after we rescue Chrome, if we use the steam gorilla as a tank, can we give this Akasa army a little bit of hard time? Wait, they're gonna bully them? Even if we don't fight. Things will just clear up, right? Haha, <laughs> after we crash into the cell, it, uh, it, won't be, it won't be able to move properly. This was meant to be used to rescue Crumb and then thrown away. Really? Like shocked. This is a one use only mecha, meant, meant to shock and surprise. If they figure out what we're up to, no matter how we strategize to use the vehicle, it won't matter. There, over there, and there. All of those are traps for suicide attacks. Oh, we got spikes coming out. Wah ha ha. Then even some idiot comes to save the hostage. They're as good as annihilated. It's no use. It's a trap, thank you. If you come to save me, I have to, I have to tell thank you and others. Someone, please, huh? Oh, like, shoot. What am I saying? Come save me. Please. Someone please. Like some brass screaming for their parents to come save them. But that's wrong. I'm the one who will save. Thank you and others. Wait. Thrown away is such a waste. If we take the time to add fortifications, can we use this to regain control of the uh, miraculous cave? Don't try to if or maybe me. We're wasting your time. You're wasting time. Huh. If only Chrome could break out by himself. I'm breaking out by myself. He's on it by himself, okay? With the power of science. That's right. I'm the science user Chrome. Escape. XSU. That's in. So, Sukasa so laid trap for Senku. Now you just cried, uh, paper, carbon fiber. Made a big tank. But how is Chrome gonna get out? Hmm. I don't know. What, what do you think? How do you think he's gonna get out? And. Yeah. If you're new, subscribe, like, comment. If you enjoyed the chapter, leave a like. Uh, thank you for watching. And have a good rest of the day. Bye.